Bringing up Bates fans are talking about which members of the family might end up rebelling. Some of the kids have begun to drop hints that they're not following their family's super strict rules, and it looks like they might go down a different path. So, what has been revealed? And who do fans think might rebel against Kelly Joe and Gil Bates' strict guidelines? Keep reading for all of the details. Bates' kids begin breaking rules. If you follow the Bates family on social media, you may know that some of the kids have begun breaking the rules. For example, as the kids have grown up and gotten married, some have ditched their family's strict dress code. Growing up, the girls wore long skirts and dresses and didn't show much skin. Now, they have much more modern styles and aren't afraid to show off their bodies. In general, fans believe that the girls ditch the dress code once they get married because their husbands might not necessarily agree with it. That could explain why Alyssa, Josie, Carlin, Katie, and other Bates sisters now wear jeans, leggings, and other less modest clothing. A new photo has sparked a conversation about which of Gil and Kelly Joe Bates' kids might end up rebelling. It looks like it could be someone who's unmarried. On Reddit, a fan shared a snap from one of Katie Bates and Travis Clark's recent YouTube videos. Though the couple lives in New Jersey, they flew to Tennessee this past week to give many members of the Bates family the chance to meet their baby, Haley James. Which bringing up Bates star might rebel? In one clip, Warden Bates met his newest niece. As he snuggled the baby girl, fans spotted what looks like a tattoo on his wrist. Below, you can see the photo in question. It's unclear whether this is a permanent or temporary tattoo, but it certainly has fans talking. This is the first time fans have noticed a tattoo on any of the Bates kids, so it's quite a big deal. Plus, Warden supposedly still lives at home at just 19 years old. One fan speculated if he could, I bet Warden would be down to get an ear piercing and wear the dangling cross. Another bringing up Bates fan chimed in, if it's a tat, I'm so intrigued. The Rebel Bates. Someone else made it clear just how big of a deal this is. They explained, a tattoo would be the biggest fundy rebellion since Jill Dillard drinking wine coolers. Fans seem to think Warden Bates is the rebel of the family, based on this incident alone.